forgot to move the thing over. Oops. There we go. <laughs> Number five. No term left. By our by. Boy, this loading is taking Previously, a lot longer than I thought it would. Dead. What if my parents come home and I'm not there? I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. Here, you can have some too. That's what it was, the batteries were but just we'll dead. in Savannah, and my parents were in Savannah. They always stay in the same place when they go there. The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? We gotta go! <laughs> yeah. Why? Clementine? We all knew Clementine! We all knew it was that. No. No. Clementine's gone. Wherever she is, I have to find her. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. She's my family now. She's all I got. Hell. In the end, family's all that matters. Maybe you should stay with the boat. Okay, sure. I honestly think it would have been better if they kept Lee around for at least one more season. I mean, shit. here there doesn't have to be any trouble here all i want is the girl give her back and nobody needs to get hurt yeah are, are you all right where are you Vernon, you son of a bitch Vernon, put clementine back on i want to talk to her this is Vernon, and you should really watch your tone clementine's fine but if i were you Fucking dead! I don't know who you are, but I will kill you! Do you understand? I know you will. She knows you will. Say goodbye. Goodbye. <sighs> it's time to go get baby girl back. Just hold on. Don't worry, pal. We'll get her back. Oh, I'm pal now, huh? How's that feeling? Not great. My hand is hot and it's thumping a little bit. You seem okay for now. Yeah, totally. We don't have much time. Really, all this We're about time. To have a lot less. We'll all make sure nothing gets in. You're still the smartest fucker out of all of us. Try to find another way out of here. Probably not the best time for conversations. Surgical supplies. Nothing. Oh, 
might be looking for something. Looks like a car, Jack. I don't want to imagine this being used on a body. Ugh. Rib splitter? Ugh. That's just nasty. Have these doors open in two seconds. But is that the best idea? So it begins, everyone. Is he alive? Yes. Fuck! Tell me who it is. Okay. This has to be done. Sorry, pal. We gotta do it. Whoa! Stop! He's awake! He's still bitten. So? This is about trying to save him. At the very least, buy him some time. Chopping his arm off. Do we know it works? We don't know anything. We know there's gonna be a lot of blood. There's gonna be a shitload of blood. But if he dies... Then the rest of us go after Clementine and get the hell out of Savannah. Damn right. Let's do this. If there's a chance it stops you from turning, we have to take it. Hey, I'm laying right here. Sorry. It's not really our call anymore. Yeah, no shit. If we take off the arm, and you don't die of blood loss, well, maybe you won't die from the bite. What do you think? No. I didn't leave it. Are you sure? Yeah, I feel like I got time. Just keep an eye on me. I get my hands on the bastard who's got Clem. But you're gonna die. Yeah, but not in here. You guys keep an eye on that door. I'll work on getting us out of here. Lee? No. This is what we're doing, and I don't want to hear anything else, okay? I had that door all the way open. I don't know what this game is trying to say. All right, up we go. We're gonna have to go as quiet as possible and see if we can make it to an empty floor or even the roof. Sounds good. I think there's some timed events that I have to do. Nice and quiet, everybody. There's some light up there. Good. Gotta get my ass off this ladder. <laughs> Dang, people dead in the elevator? That's Okay up there? Oh, just fucking peachy. Lee, Lee. Dang. Oh God, are you alive? Get up.
you have to pull yourself up. Man, that must have been super uncomfortable. Because I don't think cutting off the arm gives you any more time or not. Hospital no held. Remember when Savannah was empty? Those Crawford bastards did one thing right, I guess. There must be thousands of them. They didn't follow us here, did they? It sure seems like it. That's crazy. They can't track. They just roam. Is it? That fucking train wasn't exactly discreet. Maybe we can wait for an opening. We could be waiting a long time. Still. Lee's right, and that we gotta pick our time and go. Anybody know how far and in what direction the mansion is? We probably ought to start there. It's between us and River Street, but we can stop if we have to. Retrace our steps, maybe. And they get going towards a hotel where Clem's parents were staying. Okay. Look, let's get our bearings and see if we can figure out a way to make it across town. Good? Good. I... I don't think we can ignore what just happened to Lee. It's the bite. Just have to deal with it. You gotta let us know if you start feeling funny, you know? I know. It's just dizziness, that's all. I'm all good. As good as you can be. Yeah. Good as I can be. Now what? We get down and we find a little girl out there. Right, pal. Now, let's get our bearings. There's the door. Ladder. It's an extension ladder. <laughs> this way that looks like Crawford Square over there fuck that place did fix up our boat though we get Clementine and get right back make sure she wears a life jacket okay something tells me she's not gonna want to say anything nah I'm just uh it's taking a minute, actually. Sorry, I, I know I shouldn't. There's a bell tower over there. We know what those do. Yeah. Could be part of how we get through the streets. Yeah. Any thoughts about anything else? Nah, I'm all right. Just needed to take a second. I'll keep an eye out over here. Sorry. What's going on? That's just... everything. Fuck, man. Yeah. You know. I do. I can't thank you enough for what you did for Duck. I don't know how I'd be if you hadn't. Don't dwell on it. I look at where we are, right now, and I can't imagine Cat and Duck and all this mess. Can't. No. No, I'm sorry. We're in a fucking hurry to get off this roof. It's, it's not the time. I'm sorry. I'm okay. How many you think are wandering around underneath us right now? Yeah, how many? In the hospital? Thousands. Interesting. Who knows? It was full of dead before, right? Yeah. That's what I was thinking. And out there? Look at that dust. Fuck, man. Who knows? The 
do this. That looks like Crawford Square over there. Look at that place. Footprints. He or she walked away from whatever accident happened. Well, that doesn't really mean much. That's the church across the street from the mansion. Rubber Street should be <clears throat> just beyond that. We need to head back that way. We'll stop off at the mansion, like you said, and make sure we didn't overlook anything. Yeah. I might have a way to clear us a path. I can make it to that bell tower. I can draw the walkers down to that side of the hospital. There'll be thousands of them. That'll thin out the streets between here, the mansion, and Rubber Street. Even if it's just for a few minutes. That's the church across the street from the mansion. Rubber Street should be just beyond that. Anything over here? Honestly, my vision isn't great. I think it's allergies or all that shit those walkers are kicking up. Got any good ideas for getting through that, uh, herd? I'm working on it. Are you gonna be able to hang in there? I have to. The mansion's that way. Yeah. If we can use that bell tower to bring them to that side of the hospital, it won't be an easy trip back toward River Street, but it wouldn't be impossible. I'm with you. Just have to get over there. Allergies. Shit. People used to get those. I know, right? You never see anybody in an end-of-the-world story with hay fever. It's not the time to get wistful. Let's just deal with Cliff. It's everything. Let's put this rage inside me like I can't even say. I used to get allergies too, and just... Fuck. Who was that guy? Someone with priorities? I was thinking you and Omid wouldn't come with me. We look out for each other, but we sure as hell weren't gonna let you go alone. Not with that time bomb chewed into your wrist. You two have been solid since day one. What the hell they have? Day three? Four? Well, I appreciate She's it. questioned us every step of the fucking way. You know what, game? Fuck that bitch. Right? Omid's been Al. Omid's been a bud. Kenny's been bipolar and shit. What's up over here? Bell Tower. That's what's up. Hmm. Yeah. That could help. With the bell tower on this side of the hospital, and the mansion over there, uh, that might be our way off this rooftop. I can make it to that bell tower. I can draw the walkers down to that side of the hospital. There'll be thousands of them. That'll thin out the streets between here, the mansion, and River Street. Even if it's just for a few minutes. Hey. Let's get some talking out the way. How's the leg? It's doing a lot better. Thanks for going into Crawford for me. Even if it wasn't entirely for me. Clementine, too. She's tough as hell. Isn't she? Yeah. Don't worry more than you should about her, okay? I think you're Clem's favorite, you know that? Really? Yeah, she's a big fan. You get away with shit I never would. Hey, there we go. We're getting her back, Lee. You know that, right? Yeah. So we're good for whenever we want to we'll do get that. Out of sight and leave you with him. You get me? I get you. I'll see if we can make it out to that bell tower. Okay. Be careful though. I don't want you going any sooner than you have to. Thanks.
Notre yeah. Dame. Could buy us some time. Draw as many as we can this way. Get down off the roof on the opposite side and bust our asses getting back to the mansion. You think you should be the one to go? My leg's feeling better. Let me do it. If we have to decide who takes a risk like this, it should be the guy who's got the least to lose. What's the worst that could happen? I get bitten again? So we're agreed then. Hurry. Yeah, what she said. I would have tried to have bound the ladder so it wouldn't have. Uh... Oh shit. Ah! Ah! Boom. Headshot. Holy shit, man! Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Try to find another way out of there? It's locked. Shit. The exit in here's locked! Coming this way. Tons of them. Jesus. Now get back Jesus. here. I think I have to jump. There's no way back. You can make it. It ain't that far. Just a little hop. I think I got it. Got it. First try. Good goddamn leap, pal. Let's get the hell off this roof. Damn, he was not happy. You do it. Don't get mad. The boat's gone. No shit, it's gone. Relax. Then what happened? They were waiting for me in here. Who? Vernon, his whole crew. Was Clementine with them? No. He seemed pissed you guys lost her, and well, they took it. They're gone. Ben, you are worthless. How's Lee feeling? Don't change the subject. I can't believe you didn't even put up a fight. Omid, can you go over the fence and let us into the backyard? We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. This is not happening. Everything is so fucked. Clementine is still out there. So we get Clementine, and then what? We get the fuck out of cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. Yeah, that seems like a good idea to me. Nobody asked you. You just did. Don't get fucking smart with me, Ben. Chill. Do you remember we had a boat? A boat! 
Everyone keep it together. Nothing has changed, has it? Nothing has changed? I mean immediately. We stay the course. Don't turn on each other. Yeah, chill out, Kenny. Not the time, Ben. We can do this in the yard. Ben, I swear to God. What do we do without a boat? Get to the countryside. You've dicked around with cities and coastlines and boats too long. Take her out there. Live as safe as you can, okay? Look, I agree with you. I think out in the country is the safest place to be. But you're not dead yet, so put a pin in that, okay? I'm dead yet. I'm gonna Where turn. Where the hell do you get off? I'm just saying we should all chill. Not just you. Chill? Bandits, hey, chill. Here's some pills. Vernon, chill. Here's our fucking boat. This isn't my fault. I can't point to one thing that's happened that isn't somehow your fault. Lee should have left you in Crawford. Fuck you, Kenny. Careful, guys. No, let him. I am so, so, so sorry about Katja and Duck. I am. And I know I fucked up, but stop pushing me around and stop wishing I was dead. No! You know how they died. You said goodbye. I never got to see my family, my parents, my little sister. Do you get that? Your family is gone, but at least you had them to lose. I never made it home. <clears throat> they could be alive or dead or walkers or worse, and I don't know. So give me a fucking break. Oh, Ben. Um... Oh, shit. Here they come. In the house. And this is why you don't have shouting competitions in your yard or your house. Because the neighbors come over. They shouldn't be able to get into the backyard, right? Maybe not. We can secure this place. Krista. Search the house for weapons. On it. Kenny. Move anything you can up against the doors and windows. That's what I was thinking. Ben. Kill anything that gets in. You know you're talking to me, right? Ben, just do it. Oh me. What is it? Go now, front hallway. Ew. Lee, help! Cut their fucking arms off. There's got to be a knife or something in there. Hurry! Nice. Take their goddamn arms off! Now what? Who the hell left the front door open? Shh. Everybody. We have to hide, and then find a way out. Lee's right. This place is secure. We're patient, and then we get going. <laughs> Dang, Bree's already back. Get upstairs! Go! Shut up, bitch. I 
I was five. I'm out! Me too! Fuck! Where do we go? There's no goddamn opening! Up! Go! Why was there a red mist? Oh, come on, they ain't that fast. Get the fuck out of here. Next, you're gonna tell me they they're gonna use the rope to uh, get down. Here, um, I'm not very good at this. You dropped it down there. Not that it matters. That could have gone better. Everyone okay? Lee still bitten. Shut up. Okay, let's get out of here and keep moving. Kid's right. We gotta keep moving. Think there's any chance we get Clem and catch up to those goddamn thieves? I don't know. Maybe. But we're not going out through this window. No latches, no roof access, and 30 feet straight down. Anyone have any ideas? I bet this guy would. He's got a resourceful air about him. Knock it off. Dixon Kent the third. Industrial we need Krista. Just trying to lighten the fucking tone. We need solutions, not stupid jokes. I'm sorry. So, no ideas then. There's gotta be another way. Check the floor for any other access, a vent, anything. Or we wait for the house to clear out and stick to the high ground. Whoa, Lee, you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna. Get up! You hear that? Yeah, I did. What does that mean? She's at the hotel where her parents were staying. He hasn't moved her yet. Yeah. Yeah. We need to start thinking about more than just Clementine when it comes to our urgency. What do you mean? How do we get out of here? That's the whole point. We don't know. Okay, now your life depends on it. How do you get out of here? I don't know. I don't get it. I do. Stop it. We can't panic. How long you think we have? What? I... I don't know. We should have cut it off. At least then there would have been a chance. Well, you didn't. And it's too late now. I think we need to have an adult conversation about what happens if Lee takes another spill. Look, we could be looking at a Larry situation here. Who's Larry? It don't matter. He looks fine to me. I think it'd be best if we just worried about getting to Clem right now. We're not going to do her any good if you've attacked us. That isn't going to happen. Oh, that. Guys, I don't know what happened think... before Omid and I showed up, but we can cross the game this bridge is, uh... to it. Lee, I'm not advocating anything here, but how is this not a thing? We're all so worked up about Clementine that we're forgetting what the fuck happened to you. My arm is not the issue. I'm not the problem. The 500 walkers in the house and no door in this room are the goddamn problem. Yeah, maybe at the moment, but who's to say when it becomes an issue? At that point, there may not be any time left to deal with it. This is getting out of hand. You're gonna listen to me. We will get Clementine back, with or without you. Because I haven't given up everything to die because we were stupid. I'm sorry, okay? Fuck, we can't do this! We're gonna have to! You ruined that dude's face. Shut up, sweetie. Look. It's corroded to hell. What's on the other side of this wall? A 30-foot drop? No. This mansion butts up against the one next door. I'll be damned. This wall ain't shit. Is that really possible? This wall ain't shit. <laughs> yeah, we 
can do this. Okay. We'll work in shifts. Omid, Krista, and I. Lee, you rest. We have to work fast. Sorry. Me too. I get it. Go sit down. Glad you told us when we got bitten. Would have been easy not to. Yeah. Well. We probably would have let you go alone if you hadn't told us, which would have been a mistake. If I were you, I would have been scared shitless. I am. Uh, and when it happened? I panicked. But now I have a week of anxiety. Like the day before you get the flu. It's horrible. Wish you would have taken it off. Don't think it matters much now. I'm losing a lot of feeling in here. Really? Yeah, it's hot, like when you break a bone. Tingly, like it's asleep. So when you get this guy, what do you think? We make sure he never takes anybody from anyone again. Bro's got enough he wanted. And, you know, whatever happens to you, Seriously, can we not talk like that? The entire time we were at the hospital, I could sense you think you're as good as dead. I'm bitten, Krista. We all know that's a wrap. There's gotta be something. I want you guys to take her. Stop it. I'm serious. She'd be safe and relatively happy with you two. We're not doing this right now. Krista. Or are we? Listen to him. It's what I want, okay? What about him? Yeah, gotta support him. He's only a kid still. So it's easy to forget that. He loses shit like that often? No. That was a first. It's good that he did. Kenny couldn't pull that shit on me. Kid killed his family, so there's been some tension there. Really? What happened? Kenny's son got bitten during a raid by some gang that Ben was secretly helping. They used him. Kenny's wife died because of his son. Jesus. Well, seems like he got through to Kenny, so that's good for him. All right, I'm out of gas. You look good and rested. Sure, if you don't count an infected leg. You want me to do it? Nah, and you can hop in after me. <clears throat> Shouldn't be long now. It's good we're forced to take a breath. I still can't believe you went and got chomped. Just fucking hell. At least he told us. Took some brass. I don't think I would have. How are you? I'm... Uh, I don't know how to answer that. I'm sorry. You've lost more than anyone. It'll be all right, Ken. Why are you acting like what's happened ain't happened? Anyway, I appreciate it from both of you. A lot of us have lost families. Maybe take it easy on him from here on out. I'm angry as hell. I did. I never really thought about it that way. This guy tell you much about what we've been through? Bits and pieces. Before y'all, we had this woman, Lily, with us. Lord knows where she is now. Anyway, we had to make some tough calls with her dad. She came between Lee and I pretty good. I spent a lot of nights hating this guy's guts. After everything, he was still a bastard, wasn't it, Ken? Been hearing that my whole life, Doc. Well, cheers. 
I thought it was a sarcastic thing. Keep a goddamn eye out. <clears throat> this place seems pretty sealed off. Well, well, shit. seen go they got to do it their own way we got don't you say that you stick it out as long as you can you do whatever you have to i could have done more you did everything you could no lee i could have been a better husband better father could have been a better friend so let's figure out a way out of here. Get that little girl. We should move. Got at least one shot left. Let's clear the room before we move on. Lee, figure out where we're headed. <clears throat> Lee, you okay? Yeah. Let's keep at it. Not sure that's a good idea. Don't ask me how I'm doing. Let's just keep going. I guess Crawford would have gotten them anyway. <coughs> Judging by the decor of this room, I'd guess they were PBS watchers. Hey, my parents' house looked a lot like this. And they watch kung fu movies. Just saying. Hard to believe the world once felt this peaceful. You still with us, Biff? Yeah, Lee. I just want to help. Do you, boy? It's sick, but think of all the pain they avoided. What are you doing, pissy? What do you call this thing? Art? Might be the way out. Nothing other than personal items in here. Looks like we can stay off the streets all the way to River Street if we're careful. Let's go. Go ahead. What are you doing? Sincere. What are you doing?
my fucking mouth. Holy fuck! What are we gonna do? Stay up here. Keep an eye out. Okay, but I can't see much from up here. Just let us know if they start coming down the alley. We'll be back. Be careful. Just get me out of here. Shh, quiet, Ben. Or they'll be on top of us. Yeah, try to keep your mouth shut. I'm sorry. Just get me up. My legs hurt, I think. We're gonna get your ass up. Really? I thought you... Ooh. What is it? I'm okay. I'm okay. We can get you up. We can, uh... Ow! Oh! Oh! He's quiet. We can take our time and save his life. I can be super quiet. Not anymore. Fuck! Fuck! <laughs> oh god, don't let them get to me! Do you have any bullets left? This has only got one left in it. I'm out. Shit. Get the fuck out of here. What? Go back. She needs you, Lee. Kenny! This is not a discussion! Okay. I'm going. Good. Get back up there. Now! Fuck. Leave him, Ken! I can't let you do this! Fucking go! You sons of bitches! Yeah! I think Kenny escapes no matter what. But this is interesting because he. If we didn't have Ben, he would have dropped at some point. What happened? Up, Kenny couldn't leave him, and he was just fucked. God damn, God. I heard a shot. Kenny made sure that Ben didn't feel any more pain than he had to. What? It was Ben's biggest fear, you know. Kenny had one bullet, and that's how he used it. God, poor fucking kid. <laughs> you saw them die? Nobody was getting out of there. I'm sorry. wasn't a bad guy. A lot of folks might not have always agreed.
We should go. Right behind. What are you doing back there, Missy? Do you want to talk? That's two on you now. The motherfuckers got Clementine has been and Kenny to answer for. Keep a clear head, Lee. We wouldn't be out here. We'd all been together to defend against Vernon. And we'd be out on the water. Everyone would be alive. Look, Lee, this is a shitty time, but I want to clear something up. What is it? Now with Kenny gone, means Omid and I have to stay safe. For her. You guys would be great for her. We do our best. You know that. What's going on with you? I just saw your friends get killed. I mean, four. Back in the attic. It's nothing. What's nothing? Let's just keep moving. This was made. Can't tell if this is gonna break or I guess not. Okay. River Street's just up ahead. <coughs> oh, careful. Even the buildings are full. You never know where the next meal is. Be careful through here. Yeah, we don't need any more accidents. I'm sorry. It's okay. Now it's interesting, I think that if Kenny doesn't sit go down to save the kid, he will there's a woman in there and he wants to save her for some reason. Marshall's Hotel is around the corner of the block. We have to cross here. Well, at least it doesn't look like a death trap. Who's going first? You're the lightest. He's got a busted leg, and you're walking for two. I'm obviously not doing so hot. The decision doesn't make itself. I'll go first, in case anything happens out there. You sure? Yeah. Just go nice and slow. I went had them go first if they would die. Almost there. It's an easy crossing. Good. I mean, close to the edge should be should be at its it honestly oh, should be at its most stable. Shit. Are you okay? Fine. I'm kind of fucked here. What are you gonna do? I'm going for it. Going for it? What does that mean? 
It means I'm already bitten. I just have to push my way through. What the fuck? Let's meet outside of town, by the train. Are you nuts? It's the only way. Do you hear me? Yeah, by the train. Jesus, we'll be there. I mean, honestly, I could. I don't see why Lee couldn't pull himself up and just go. I'm just saying. Wait, buddy, I gotta ask you a question. should look familiar. How do I know it's that one? Knock, knock, bitch! Really, where is he? He was out? He got us adjoining rooms. Oh, that's right. He was in the adjoining room. Where is she? I already told you. She's fine. Oh, she yeah. You look horrible. Go over there. Put your things down. Let me out! He's out there. Shh. Quiet, please, sweetie. Crazy. Your things. Mother. There. This is all I've got, okay? You travel light. I don't believe you. 
That's everything. Go ahead and search me. No, I'm not touching you. Just sit down. See anything else you want to know? Shut up, fool. Lot left. Everything was just out there for the taking. We were starving. Do for you the taking? Do you know what you took from me? Would you start on who took what from who? I didn't take her from you. I rescued her from you. Don't you get that? Somebody you care about? Not on purpose. If it were on purpose, you'd be a sociopath. I hurt her. What did so you do? Bad. Creeper. My son Adam went missing. I took him out hunting, even though my wife said he was too young. I figured he had to learn. I came back without him when the look on her face said, You are a monster. We all went out looking for him. We never found him. I hurt her so bad. Then he took all of our things. He robbed us. I could have earned her trust back, maybe, but not. Until she finally took our daughter Elizabeth and left. Oh, I still had one kid. They didn't get far. I found them a day later in the road. Do I look like a monster to you? Yes. Yes. If you think that now, you just wait. I'm not. You killed a man with a pitchfork right in front of a little girl. It's more complicated than that. You let a boy get yanked out of a window and into the night so you could protect a pretty girl with a gun. It was impossible to save him. To save them both. <coughs> the sweatshirt she's wearing was my boy's. You stole that from us. So my family starved in the cold. I think in the apocalypse it's called Binders Keep. <laughs> How could you know all this? You're a monster. You're a murderer and a thief. And I'm going to hurt you. So bad. Doesn't have to be this way. You can't take care of anyone. After I heard Clementine on the radio and realized who you folks were, I came after you purely for revenge. But the more I heard about the things you did and the danger she was in, our plan changed. Leave, listen to me. I need you to hear this before what happens next. I can take care of her. We can have a family. I bet you don't even know how old she is. She's eight. Wrong. She's nine. But Her birthday was six days ago. I know how to be a dad, you know. She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been reading. Yeah, so did Vernon, and both of their kids are dead. That's not happening. You're crazy. Keeping her with you is crazy. Let us 
us go. No. No, I don't think so. You're going away, and we're starting a new thing. Hey, honey. I think this is all going to work out. Do you... Got it. I wish it wouldn't have had to get this bad, but it's all over, hon. Isn't it? Just about. I hate seeing you like this. I just miss your smile, honey. I miss you so much, Tess. You're gonna like Clementine a lot, though. She's not Lizzie, but she's sweet. She wouldn't hurt a fly. <laughs> Um, excuse you? Very fucking little? Hey, honey. I think this is all gonna work out. Did you just you... fuck that up? What? I'm glad to. <clears throat> I wish it wouldn't have had to get this bad, but it's all over, hon. Isn't it? Just about. I hate seeing you. <laughs> I miss you so much, Tess. You're gonna like Clementine a lot, though. She's not busy, but she's sweet. She wouldn't hurt a fly. Close. You hear the smashing? He had, the, he had them crazy goddamn eyes. I would have cut his head. Still a good night. He would have come back. Those words. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Shh. It's okay. It's okay. You look horrible. <laughs> Let's just get somewhere safe. You don't smell good. Yeah, I know. Did he hurt you? No. Not really. I'm sorry, Lee. Leia, it's okay. We need to get you somewhere safe. Everything's okay now. We need to figure out how to get out of Savannah as fast as we can. I'm sorry you had to see that. He was going to kill you. And take you. What's the crazy guy got in the bag? Jesus. Don't look at there. No, I know.
Why is it a gunshot? You have the fucking knife, dude. It it didn't bite you. Yeah. I know it. it must have. You're covered in all that gross stuff. Had to get through a bunch of them to get here. That's how we'll get out of Savannah. That's just nasty. One more. I want to be sure. Just a little more. It's so gross. There. That should do it. Gives a whole new f meaning to the phrase guts I for hope garters. So. Shit, I forgot the radio. I don't know if that has any significance. Burke. Well, here's hope. I don't know if I have to wait or like a bad version of a friggin' biker gang. Excuse me. Lee, wake up. Please don't be dead. Please, no. Lee, I was so scared. I, I, I thought you left me. I, I, I saw my parents. Got away. <clears throat> They're dead for sure. Clementine, we have to get out of here as fast as we can. Well, we can't. There's thousands of them outside. We have to. I'll protect you. We'll push no, through. No, no, that's crazy. I saved you. 
We're safe here. I locked us in. Get that door open. I can't. Do it! <clears throat> it was only a little open when I found it. I closed it to keep us safe. Hold on three. One, two, three. supposed to take care of you. I can't now. I know. I, I think there might be a way out over there. Good, good girl. Let's go. <coughs> be a little slow. by bringing you in here. Oh, you did, honey. It's awful out there. They would have chewed me up. It was hard. I don't know how you did it. But you did good. Okay? Keep going. We're almost there. Poor clam. Let's see. Get up, please. What is this gentleman doing? The door is doing? right here. <clears throat> I can't. You have to. Liam, I can't move. This is it for me here. Please, Aww. please, try to get up. It's caught there. I can't. You don't have much time. You gotta do something. Fast. Like what? You need to get out of here as soon as you can. I, I can't leave you. Let's work on getting out, okay? We'll figure it all out. Will we, though? Baseball bat. There's a baseball bat under the counter, Clem. You can use that. Nice. <clears throat> Use the bat to shut that window so bat. you can reach in, okay? Use okay. the bat. Watch out for broken glass. Good job. I know. I mean, am 
I supposed to? Oh, hey, what's this? To reach in to the lock. I was like, what the fuck am I doing? <laughs> Open it. <clears throat> he's, he's trapped. This will be easy then. He's got keys. Probably to that door. And everything you Handcuffs on me. Attach me to this. What? Why? No matter what happens, I'm safe then. Uh, I don't know. Just do it, sweetie. Make sure to tie. I don't. I don't want to do this. What are you doing? You have to. It'll keep you safe. Only have to the cat again. Her. Here she comes. What are you doing? Ah, uh, Missy. What are you doing, Missy? The keys and then the gun. Yeah. The keys and the gun. Just don't be afraid. Don't think it's dangerous. The I know you want, he you want attention. What should I get first? How does it fall on me? <coughs> really? <coughs> Fuck him up. Fuck him <coughs> up. Time. Here you can. Don't worry. Hey. You're strong. Do anything. Are you? But I'm little. Doesn't mean nothing. You go see bad stuff, but it's okay. My parents. It's so horrible. I, I can't imagine being. And now you. Please. Please don't be one of them. How? Please don't become a walker. There's only one thing you can do. Hey. You know that. Claws hurt. I don't know if I can. I think it's time to take you to get your nails trimmed again. You have to shoot me, honey. Please. Otherwise, we'll see him no. again in the story. It's okay. I don't know if we will or not. It's okay. Honey, I'm, is it time to go I'm get your nails no trimmed again? Because you're digging in my so freaking knee. <laughs> sorry, you're in that position now. Like if anything, Ow. I mean not to be. Oh, honey. But you just have to point it at me. Close your eyes and thank me. You never have to see ow, me as one ow, of the ow. other. You can do it. I know you can. You know, little shit. These are new jeans. Okay, 
I can do it. I I can. That don't need it, Krista. You're outside of town. Got your tail. I got your tail with my foot. Ha ha, what are you gonna do? Ha ha. Yes. Good. It'll take good care of you. I need Clem. This is actually very uh, this was actually a very emotional time. Keep that hair short. I will. I'll cut it myself. This entire first game was not fair it? emotionally. It was no, so not don't fair. Worry. All right. Don't be afraid. Pixels kind of. It was totally not fair. It's really not. The Walking Dead. Size and one. I know I keep messing with my hair. It's just that no one's here to talk to me. I like talking to people. All right, remove Lee's arm. 32% of players did not. I probably thought it was all bad. Fallout, lost temper, calmly argued, uh, disarm, gave up weapons, kept your weapons. Clement killed Clementine's captor. There was a way to not kill him. That is, that is overwhelming, the last one. 95% of you did not let Lee turn. It's because our baby girl cares about us. She didn't want to see us in that condition. You defended his son. You're not the water for duck. I feel like... Is there a way to keep him alive? Uh, you stood up for Ben and the and Crawford. Ben fell to his death. Saved her life. She was killed by Lily. Uh, oh. <coughs> so there it is. I don't know if this is going to have 